what's up guys in this video i am going to show you how we will read our files using apache camel so let's get started now this is my github repository i am using for all the practicals which i will perform in this tutorial so do check it out from the link the link to this repository is in the description section of this video further the prerequisite of this video is having eclipse so to download the eclipse just go to eclipse.org and inside this in the right hand corner upper side there is a download button just hit it okay then you will get there fine so get this uh, this is the latest version 2021.03 so download it from here and then install it after double click since i have already installed it so this is my eclipse right here now let's check it out this repository so you can also work this one from here this so i will check out using ssh because my keys are already added and this is my folder i will right click and open git bash here and here i will use git clone it's cloning the whole code from this repository okay so inside this there are many projects i want projects which are mentioned so for this tutorial since we are in this file reader we have to read file from one place and put it to another place so use this project file reader cam so i will get into this pro clone repository okay so this is my project i will import it so to import it just go here and inside this the header copy this one and then get into your eclipse and inside this go to file import and then the here just use existing maven projects then hit next here paste that location which we have copied use browse pom.xml is picked up from that project hit finish now this project has been imported right here so after this project has been imported what we have to do is here now go ahead into this java inside this java there are two files so what is happening here is let me open my paint okay. so what is happening right now is there are two paste it and paste it right there okay so let me draw one more one so this is the input pqt input and this is the now there are two folder which are input and output and there is a file which is a file so let me put down let uh, it's too short but it's fine so what i am want is i i want is that i want this file this this whole file which is right now in the input directory and then what i will do is out i will get it into this output so in this scenario what we are doing is there is a bunch of files which are in files that in input oh they are in on output i will copy them back to the input whenever because we have to process them so i will copy it and then paste it fine i have copied it now i can delete them from the output location 
okay so i am only having files these files in my input directory so these files one is the csv file let me show you this one is the csv file these are the jsons which are available so these are the three files so what we want is we want these files after getting picked up by the apache camel and then log into our console and then put those files inside the output directory so this is the whole structure we want to pick up the file from input directory and put it into the output directory so so we are going to achieve this using apache camel so to achieve this we just have to put one processor or sorry processor not this file from file that is files and specify the direct directory of the files since i i am in the root of the project there is a folder named files that is specified this files and a slash input and i am to log the body in the console use dot log body and the third thing is use dot to file files and output so in this way it will output that file in this directory right the next thing which i am want you to know is about this camel so the component is where which class we define our routes and the routes are written inside the configure method which holds this throws exception is important and this file which is our java file class extends the route builder so these are the important thing in this file everything else is from spring and let's hop to over this pomo.xml so this is the pom the dependencies which are needed for the spring with camel is these one one is the apache camel starter this one these two dependencies are not required so i'll comment it out shift so i have commented them out fine so these two dependencies are not needed the only dependencies are required are one second third and this now let's run this processor so to run this processor what i have to do is get this and then right click and run as spring boot app now it will ask me to hit ok our files will be picked up from here and then now let's refresh it now my spring has been started started we'll log all the files which we have provided in the input directory let's see yeah so this is the first file that is the csv one which is logged there another is the json file first json and then this is second json so these are the files which are logged there and these are now available in our output directory so this is how we will pick up file from one directory that is input and store them into output fine so do check out the code in the description section of this video thanks for watching and for more videos and subscribe to know more about apache camel and more stuff check out or feel free to visit our website rdtech.net and check out the blog section also.